What's going on guys? It's your boy Insane Cheetos and we're back with another Pixel Car Racer. Uh as you can see that I have improved I have thousands of races. I have won a thousand races. I have one golden trophy, two silver. I'm still trying to get those goldens, but I, I don't know what that this right there is, so I'm just gonna not pay attention to that. So all this right there, I just go in hand. Uh, I am at level 100 as you see uh, you cannot put no more stats. It's just it's just there now uh, I Think I'm gonna change my appearance. I, th I think I'm gonna change my appearance now. So we're gonna go with something something bit me We have pocket change you got the pocket chains on look at those pocket chains, okay, uh You got anything like a deep dark red or something? Let me see. I, I think I'll go with this one right here. Yeah, let's go. Now, let's go to our garage. And let's see what I have put inside this this thing right here. This is my uh, Mal drag strip car. So, and I have found out that the best tune for it is, it's absolutely insane. Uh, but let's just dyno it so you can get an understanding of what I'm making in this car. Nearly three... Well, my peak horsepower is nearly, uh, well, it is 33. I was going to say nearly 3,400, but it's 3,300 horsepower. And this is a light car, and I got, uh, I mean, my, my horsepower, when I try to max it out right now, is going to be somewhere between 29. That's without boost. That's 29.10. That's max horsepower without. And this is with boost. My max is like 31 or something like that. Anyway, let's go to my tune. As you can see, it's top speed 263. Well, not really, because I did the gear ratios is different. This is the best setup you can go for with uh, changing, getting your gears and checking stuff like that. Uh, also, I just found this out, but nothing about not these. But suspension ride height is 4.5. My launch control is 83. And my boost controller. So this is what I found on boost controller. You see this number right here, the 1018. Uh, so basically, I know you can turn your boost down, and it actually changes your um your uh, your rank. So I can go all the way to F class, all the way back up to X class, just from changing my boost around. That is a way I forgot to show you. I do have. All my cars do have Hemi's, which have 707 horsepower stock. I do have a lot of wheels. As of now, I've been deleting every. There was some nice wheels I had came across, but they were all 150 pounds of weight. I was going for the lightest, lightest wheel to go for. So 140 is what, I've, what I'm at right now. So each uh, each wheel, each tire weighs about 35 pounds. I think that's right. 35 plus 35. That'd be 70. That'd be 70 plus 2. That'd be 140. So, yeah. And we all have Demon Shot in here. I, yeah, so I've just been grinding this game. Non stop. Uh. My turbo, I do have a 24 carry gold nipple, but it's not, it's just the same as this, but this one's just black, and I got this one with crate, and I got this one from crate too, but this is on my, um, quarter, my, yeah, my quarter mile, my 1320 foot, uh, car, and I, my suspension got airbags, well, I got them bagged, VX bag, got some Avion drag, tires I gotta delete these but other than that that's pretty much where I'm at I have all three I think my cars have these on I gotta delete these because um these this one was from a crate every time you see a scar down here it's from a crate uh where it has no scar I just bought that this one's my scar car I mean scar crate now let's go into the the exhaust so I deleted these three stacks it just got the uh, four hood stack, I mean, one uh, individual hood stack for each car. And from here, I got all the PX, PRX black. 
got the VX Class SXs on all, all my cars, I believe. Yeah. And the these are all all top end except for the exhaust. This is like most power, but with less weight. Uh, all the ECUs are upgraded to the top. Uh, since I'm running a turbo on the Exorcist, which is the CI, I believe the little small CI I have right uh, in, in the parking pool, they uh, they can only use the filters. So I have the VX 4394s, which is the highest one you can get. I think I don't know. It's just weird. Uh, you got the Carbon Pro X's for uh, M2. That and then you got the wraps. You got the Harambe wrap. I already showed you all this, so I'm just gonna run through it again. I gotta delete one of these because I have three of them. Once I get three of them, I'm just gonna be. I'm gonna hope I get three so I can just uh, put them all on each car. And as for aesthetics, I have a mounting plate that I'm uh, not using it right now. I have uh, two hookers. Uh, one oil cooler that's 24 karat gold that I did get out of a. Um, a, a crate. I got all these from my tail lights, and I, then I got for each of my cars. As you can see, that this car has a uh, the yellow bolts. I mean the golden bolt, the golden nut, the lug nuts. So I put the yellow headlight sticker on this. Same goes with the other one. So I have the, a green from my other car, and then the red for the other car. I do have this. It's on my uh, I believe my Fiat. I believe. All of them have super bright uh, 8000K uh, LEDs, HIDs. And now for the wing, I have the wing that I just got. Now I bought all three of these wings. I have all the, because uh, all my cars have the Rocket Bunny on, the Rocket Bunny kit on it. So I just bought all three of these, the Ethernet out. I have a red, uh, red cage. I don't know when I got this red cage though. I did definitely get out of crate because it has uh it definitely has red that little star down there. So and next we got the bumpers. Uh well the kit. The body kits is all rocket rocket bunny. I think I only got one of them from crate. Yeah, so the ones with the star I got from crate, as I told you like previously. So I only got one kit from the crate, which actually didn't look uh, too bad on my first car I did, so I just said, fuck it, let's do it. Next, we have the spray paint. I had to read all my other one, but I'm, I think it's my blue news, too. But here's what the effect, the reflex, what the reflex spice looks like. And this, it honestly looks like it's a darker version. This looks like a darker version of this color. So, yeah. The carrot. It's it, I guess, but I just don't know. Uh, other than that, we just have all these. I'm gonna delete that bitch. I hate this. I got pumpkin, which looks nothing different than carrot, so it's a little bit darker though. A little bit darker. But I have all my cars have charcoal. And I really like it like that. It's not real black, but it has a little bit of spice to it. Like my wall and mine. Mine like charcoal gray. much it I have on there what we are going to do is we're going to take this out go to the superstition which is this one right there and as you can see they have great ones for my, um, my uh, times and the gauges there's some 21s and 12s and 7s to 6s and 10s and 18s so I've been really grinding on the green I like to work I find that it's way better because I'm probably covering up the mic anyway. So I can't really hear me. Uh, because it's, it shows the little, the white a little bit better. I don't I kind of script this podcast. Anyways, it just shows the white a little bit better so I can easily time myself and be on the uh, the throttle and the clutch faster. It'll pull out a lot, a lot better. And I learned something else. This is, this really helped me because I, I was like, okay, so 
I couldn't get the burnout right. So what I did was, as you can see, I'm like, oh, you should have stopped at the green line. I'm like, nah, that's, I'm going to show you. Just go up here, go past the green line, then stop right there so you can get right there. So when it gets, so when you pull out, it should be on that green line. Then you take that nose. And boom, running six twenty one. I think that's really bad. Oh wait, I didn't put the. My bad, my bad. Quit. I'm like, oh, I do a run six, but I'm running. Six. I forgot. To put the that's how I found out about it. So let's check the booster. Put the booster back up. It should be a lot. Cause it was full. I think I'm gonna tune it again because I did have to change the um the gearing ratios because they were really um short, I believe. But we're just gonna see when we get out there before we sign. The Aston Martin is all over. Uh, I could tell because it didn't have to uh, do a burnout. The lights were the stage was already set for it. Oh, yeah, it's a little bit laggy, but to do. Yeah, see, I have to change the gears around. I gotta just listen to the gears, but it's not too, not, not too, too shabby. But that's all I want to. That's all I wanted to say. Sorry if you didn't hear me. I had my uh my finger over the hole, so it's gonna be a little bit muffled. But that's pretty much it. That's pretty much what happened. Uh, as I said, you leave a comment. At, oh yeah, leave a comment down below if you want to see. Um, uh, finish this. If you want to see a uh, like, I don't know, some different type of cars up here, you just gotta hit me up. Uh, here's I'm not gonna show you. I'm just gonna just. Think of a car I can find it on here, like a GTR or something like that. Just hit me up. Anyways, guys, that's it for this video. Uh, thank y'all for watching. Leave a like, subscribe, comment down below, uh, and I might do a giveaway. I mean, I do have my own shirts that I sell, so and I might just throw one out. Like, yeah, you can have one might because i don't have that many people so i might just be at three people and i might just give all three of them the shirt anyways guys thanks for watching uh this this is episode two i believe two this is episode two uh share share this video with your friends hit that uh notification bell to get all the uh new uploads Oh, and I did just do a reaction to the Red Dead Redemption 2 trailer. So you need to go check that out before you check. Because uh, I'm not buying the game. I'll, I explained it inside the video. Just go watch it. And let that be that. Alright, deuces.